Welcome to Primo Trailer Sales and a first look at a brand new Catalina Summit Series 261BH. A wonderful family floor plan, a great starting trailer for somebody just starting out in the camping life, especially for families. Comes in at a great weight of 4,700 pounds dry, uh, so very, very reasonable for towing with uh, a wide variety of vehicles. And I just love this trailer for the fact that it's got sort of everything you need as you start out and nothing you don't. And uh, wonderful storage as well for a little bit smaller trailer without a, a slide. So I'm going to show you some of the great features that I really appreciate and I think that could really work for your family as well. So up front we've got uh, two 20 pound tanks underneath our cover here. We've got room for multiple batteries. We always include uh, one standard deep cycle battery here with a box and cover. Uh, Primo trailer cells. We've got our great stone guard here on the front so lots of protection as you hit the gravel roads. You'll notice uh, CSA on the front here. We do bring all our, our units in uh, to the Canadian standard, so they are uh, meeting all the propane and electrical codes here in Canada, so something the insurance companies nowadays are asking for. Beautiful arch front here, so it really helps to cut the wind. As we come around the corner, we've got the great big jacks here, all four corners, so it's very stable once you get there. We've got wonderful pasture storage, so this is the spot where you're going to put all the fishing rods, the kids' pool noodles, all the extra toys, the longer items, the brushes, the wash brushes, they fit nicely in there. We've got our power electric awning here. Uh, this is by Domenic, has this little power channel here you see. You can add some little accessories over time if you wish that'll work off of uh, 12 volt as well. So this is a push button awning, so push it, out it goes a full 8 feet. So this is where you're going to be most of the time. So really well set up, uh, covers the door, covers the window by the dinette on the inside. You've got a great screen door here, all your windows are tinted. Uh, they will all have screens as well, so you can get lots of airflow even if you don't have the ability to run the onboard air conditioning unit. It is a tandem axle unit. We've got great alloy wheels here. You're gonna notice the aluminum fenders. They are not plastic, which is a problem in the industry that oftentimes they'll crack over time. These are not gonna crack. We've got the alloy wheels, so we've really cut down on the maintenance in terms of the, uh, the rusting. They are uh, nitrogen-filled radial tires. Huge window here at your dinette, so if there's a night where obviously it's raining or it's really cold and you wanna be inside, you've got this huge window that looks onto your campsite, which I really love, so you're not looking onto your neighbors. You can still watch that fire running if you want. We've got two exterior speakers here. That's controlled by our uh, Bluetooth enabled stereo on the inside, so you can stream music to it from the outside. We've got our LED light running the full length of the awning here. As we come to the back, I love this storage. I wish every unit had this kind of storage. So this unit has a massive, massive storage compartment underneath the rear bottom double wide bunk. So this is a spot where you could put kids' bikes. Uh, I have a huge Camp Chef grill that I love bringing with me uh, that just rolls around on a set of wheels and I could slide this in here and still have room for, you know, three other kids if they were really bad, but no, just kidding. Uh, we've got room here for, you name it, so uh, any of the toys you want to bring with you, if you have an interest like golfing, for instance, I mean, you have room, you have enough length here to have you know, two or three sets of clubs back here. So you name the sport or activity, you're gonna use this storage, even if it's just for the things you're gonna use outside, like your grills and things like that. So it's a it's a wonderful storage area. It's one of those items that everybody wishes they had. More storage is key on an RV, and this definitely has it. You've got two great windows in the bunks here as well. So they, the kids both have uh, their own window, one they can slide open, there is the, uh, the screen as well. We've got the great little leash link here, so if you do bring your dog, nice thing is you always have a spot here to tie them off to if you're gone for a few minutes, or even if you just want to let them out first thing in the morning. Um, you also have a spot here where you can, again, you could uh, bring the uh, a rope or bring a, a chain and just strap the bikes to it as well for security. The back side here, we have our hot water tank, we've got our um, spare tire, so we've always got one here, we've ordered them with it, so if you're out the road, you've always got that backup. We do have a pre-wire here all set up for a wireless camera, so should you want to add one at any time, it's all ready to go. Made it nice and easy. We've got most of our connections all in this back corner, so we've got our inlet for uh, satellite and cable should it be on site. We've got our grey and black water dump valves. We've got our 30 amp power cord here, you've got about 20 feet. We do have a black tank flush on this unit, which being a more basic unit is a wonderful feature. You're really going to appreciate that. So that's going to clean out that black tank. Should you have a sewer hookup on site, you can run your fresh water right through it. And you'll notice you've got great windows on this side as well, so you're going to get lots of cross ventilation. You can slide those open. Uh, our initial uh, water hookup here, so we've got our city water hookup as well as our onboard water. And I really like the fact that we do have our furnace outlet on the back side. So should you ever want to add, uh, say, a screen room, uh, to the opposite side under your awning, you can because you don't have the carbon monoxide from the furnace exhaust coming back onto your door side. 
We welcome you down to Primo Trail Sales to come have a closer look at this stunning 261BH in Coachman's Catalina Summit Series.